It's been a busy week for Mark Peterson and the KXLY4 Extreme team. They've spent the past four days renovating transitions. <laughs> it's a living center for women and children struggling with homelessness. With one, two, and three bedroom apartments available, families may live up to two years there. Yeah, transitions, though, was in need of a little help. The building is more than, get this, 120 years old. And a touch up was definitely uh, on the list of things to do. That's where Mark Peterson and the Extreme team come in. They've been hard at work all week. We can't wait to see this, Mark. Well, good evening. Yeah, I called it the Transitions Transformation. And, of course, this whole month, Extreme Team has heart. We started the Women's Children's Free Restaurant on Washington, did a day's worth of work there, and then we transferred to Transitions. Monday, we began. We didn't start early, guys. Take a look at what we did, though, come Monday. We were checking out this office, and that's the first piece we're going to show you tonight as we begin this slow reveal. First of all, this office had hospital colors that were from the 70s. We all remember what the hospitals looked like, right? Well, imagine working in that every day and dealing with people's problems and issues and the fact that you don't have a happy workspace. We changed all that. Join me, won't you? All right, it is in here that we see the big transformation, and this is is just cleaned up. Zero Res came in and did all the carpet, the painting from Rada Paint. We had Everhart paint in here. Kevin also helped for three of the four days. He was busy, and he's just one of our volunteers. It's there that we have the geometric paint that started five years ago as a mistake. We covered a mistake with the geometric design, and now it's in every single extreme team because we have to. Davis Office Furniture helped us get things organized, and Mover Moving helped us move all the heavy stuff. But we couldn't have done it without all these guys. Come on in. Guys, I got to tell you, it is with NAWIC, National Association of uh, Women in Construction, and also Bank of America, the BOA. They're in red. We got the gray, and we got everybody else who helped us. Without them, we couldn't have done this. They were been phenomenal volunteers. Thank you all very much. And I got to tell you, uh, you guys had great ideas. So thank you very much. We'll have more coming up. KXY 4 News at 6. We'll take you into the family room first.